Hey guys, it's your boy Mark back with another video. Today is August 28th, 2021. And your boy just got done watching the latest film of John Cena, Vacation Friends. I watched this film on Disney Plus, yes, in New Zealand and uh, anywhere outside the US, I guess. Um, this uh, film released on Disney Plus for Star instead of Hulu, you know. So I was very excited about that. I was very excited to watch this film because, you know, my hero is John Cena. I love him so much, and I, I don't, if you know me, I don't need to say that, really, because, uh, y'all know how much I love John Cena. Anyway, so what this film Vacation Friends is about, it also, along with John Cena, of course, it stars, uh, Lil Rel Howery, I apologize if I butchered his name, uh, I don't remember his name exactly, but I love that guy, I love him in Bad Trip. Uh, which is my favorite film of 2021 so far, by the way. And I love him in Get Out, which is how I was introduced to him. And uh, I, I don't recognize uh, um, Lil Rel Howery's uh, uh, fiance in this, honestly. Um, but what Vacation Friends is about, it's about this the couple, you know, played by Lil How Rowry and uh, the actress who uh, plays uh, Emily. And they, uh, <clears throat> they meet this really crazy couple on vacation, and they basically spend a whole week doing a whole bunch of crazy stuff, and, uh, this couple is, they're crazy, but they're awesome, alright? The uh, John Cena, of course, is Ron, who's the guy of the couple, and his, uh, uh, girlfriend is, uh, I don't remember her name, but she is the, uh, that, uh, that, that, uh, woman from, uh, Brightburn, I remember she played a, I think she played the teacher in there, or the supervisor in Brightburn, anyway, um, and yes, they, they, they have a crazy week, and they're just crazy, unpredictable people, man, and, uh, but they're friends, okay, and, uh, several months pass after this vacation, and it's the wedding of the two, the main couple, and, um, yeah, and, uh, they, they, Ron and, uh, Kyla show up, and, uh, things get crazy, that's all I want to say, so what did I think about Vacation Friends? I had a good time watching this, okay, I enjoyed it, wasn't a masterpiece or nothing, but I had enough fun with it, and I'm glad I watched it, alright? But my favorite thing about this film, the characters by far, my favorite character, who do you think my favorite character is, it's, of course it's Ron, played by John Cena, of course he's my favorite character, he was just so awesome in this, I just love his character, and even like, of course I knew I'd love his character because it was John Cena, but the more, I love, I just loved his character more and more and more as the film progressed, and, uh, I love the, the couple too, um, and, uh, I don't like uh, the the bride's uh, brother. He well, he was a dick, and he was supposed to be a dick. I don't like him at all. And the actor who plays him, I enjoy him in other stuff. I don't enjoy his character in this though. And uh, yeah, they they're, they're crazy. This film is kind of twisty. Like there's like things that you think they mean something else, and then they actually mean a different thing, and then um. Yeah, it's, uh, the character, like I said, Ron and, uh, uh, Kyla just, that they're, that they're, 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 they're awesome, alright, and, uh, this does, this film went exactly as I expected, though, which isn't a bad thing, you know, I will admit, I got pretty emotional at the end, like, the last, like, 20 minutes, I was legitimately crying, alright, like, and I, if you don't want any spoilers, whatsoever, um, I'm just warning you right now, alright, three, two, one, um, it, it did go, you know, like, um, someone messes up, like, too much, and then there's a fallout, and then the, they, they kind of stop being friends, and then they become friends again, 
All right, this did have that, and during that part, when they realized they messed up when they were kicked out and all that, that got me emotional. I actually cried, and you realized how great friends they actually were, and all that, and, uh, yeah. If I did spoil that for anyone, I I'm I'm truly sorry, okay? I, I just, I wanted to mention that, though, and, um, this film had... A kind of surprising ending, actually. You you would... It was one of those films, like, for example... And by the way, spoilers for Avengers Endgame. Um, like, a lot of people back then, when Endgame was releasing... People thought that... Tony Stark would live a happy life, and Captain America would die. But that was like a switcheroo. So... I'm not gonna say what exactly, but... You expect this film to have a certain ending... With uh, certain characters... But you do get that ending, but with other different characters than you would expect. Yeah, that's it. Anyway, like I said, love the characters, especially Ron. Uh, I love the the couple, you know, the main, like, both couples I love. Crazy, unpredictable man, and pretty twisty, and uh, stuff said out of context, and then you realize, huh? You know? But uh, even, th there was a kind of a twist near the end that, I, I can't really make sense of, to be honest. I'm not going to say what that is, of course, but... Anyway, yes, I, I liked it. I liked this film. I would give Vacation Friends... I'll probably give it a 7. You know, a good 7. Um, uh, but the characters really carried this film for me, I think. But, yeah, anyway, that's my thoughts on Vacation Friends, y'all. Tomorrow, Top Sunday is tomorrow, so, um, yeah, um... If, uh, if I can't, uh, think of a proper, uh, Top Sunday video to do tomorrow, I'll probably just do my Top 5 Vacation Friends characters, and I'm not even joking, alright? So that's your boys' thoughts on Vacation Friends, hope you guys enjoyed, and, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys later, and, uh, peace out, y'all.